Hello there. What is going on, everybody? We're playing some Armada down in Orlando today. It's this a shorter two-round tournament at uh, Campus Cards and Games. And I'm running some Separatists today. It's a Patriot Fist list. Uh, and I wanted to run one of each of the different uh, chassis. And uh, I've got uh, a Munificent comms frigate with just the B2 rocket droids, the hard cell um, battle refit with the B2 rocket droids. I've got a Providence class carrier with TK1726. Uh, he's got thermal shields, B2 rocket troopers, and Jedi hostage. And of course we've got the Patriot Fist, kind of standard loadout for him, which is uh, ordnance experts, uh, B2 rocket droids, swivel mount batteries, and assault proton torpedoes. And he also has TKs as his officer to help him have a little token support. We'll see how well it works. Uh, be sure to like the video, subscribe, share the video, check out the links in the description below. You know the drill, all that good stuff. So just gonna click down there and, and all the links. Just click everything. <laughs> all right, so I'm playing Chandler today and we've got uh, Grievous Fleet. So uh, actually Separatist versus Separatist, which is pretty cool. Uh, he's got Rune, Medical Team, Thermal Shields, Ion Turrets. That's pretty good on them. Uh, Link Turbo Lasers, Tide of Progress. Got Watt Tambor. And uh, with Thermal Shields on a Munificent. Okay. Uh, auxiliary Shields Team. And uh, high, high, high Ion Turrets and Link Turbo Lasers. Hard Cell with Reserve Hangar Decks. Hard Cell with Parts Resupply. And uh, a whole bunch of Vulture Droids. And Not you said had one other bad. Or All right, and of course he's going to be abusing those vulture droids with Grievous. Yeah. Oh, so we'll see. Cool. And I think you had the points. Do you want, you know if you want first or second? Hmm. We got a lot of people. We are going uh, eight today. Yeah, we got eight. Yeah, yeah. So a lot, of, a lot of games running today. Um, so I started off. Yep. Cool star. We are set up. He moved from there. I moved two out and one in a little bit. Um, and uh, to point here, everybody max speed. He was going to make sure we took the battle close to the edge of the board so we can always fly somebody off to activate Grievous and get a shield token back. Uh, and, and here we go. they got a station over here, but I don't know how much useful it's, 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 it's going to be. And uh, it's, it's, Hopefully I can blow some ships up because that's kind of what I want to do here. All right, here we are at the start of round two, just maneuvering in, kind of... Oh, boy. He's, that's not Grievous, though, right? No. Oh, man. They're, 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 they're all over. Place these two. And here's how we are at the end of round two. Uh, he did get this hard cell to take a shot and got some shields off of the sides of my recusant, uh, which was, you know, not great. It was a good shot from him. But I have lots of stuff lined up now. I'm worried about this guy being able to get too close to my flagship and trigger a Jedi hostage. So I've kind of got everything geared up to take down a Munificent this turn. Uh, and I'm, I also have like double arc on this particular point right here. Um, and so we gotta add up some points. Cause I did get one last time, he got two last time. I've got a lot of dice showing. I should be able to uh, score some uh, some objective points this, for this round. Man, so yeah, he ended up, it was ended up being a seven, four. Uh, I lost my Patriot Fist by ramming on the obstacle like two, like three turns in a row. Again, it was going to happen in a, in, a, in a setup like this. And then Vulture Droid took out my flagship on the very last turn. And uh, then it, I wasn't able... We ran. Then, we actually ran time. We would have had one more round. Uh, and then I don't know what would have happened on the last round because I'd have lost the TF advantage. Yeah. I'd have lost the TF advantage. It could have went either way. So, um, but yeah, so I, I had these two guys left. That was all that was left. But I had a lot of points for the objective. And that's what actually gave me the, uh, the edge. But uh, it looked like I was gonna. It looked like I was out in a big, big lead for until that last turn. Losing my two big ships in the same turn was really, really tough. But good game. Um, freaking, you know, I, I, great objective control by just making sure that we're playing on the side where you can just send a squadron off to get a defense token back. So uh, Grievous is is unique and very fun to use, I guess. I always fly against him where he's less fun. All right, so round number two, I'm playing against a Starhawk. Uh, it's Jake, right? That's right. There's Jake. Jake is uh, running a Starhawk with uh, a Liberty. He's got Leia, Kate Kim Shulman, the Gates as an officer, engineering captain, or ion turbines, the, oh, the Magmite class, okay. So we're gonna do some speed zero shenanigans. XI7, MC80, XI7, XX9, and, uh, and you got a- No name. A big old potato with no upgrades. Yeah. This was kind of like a last minute change. Last minute having fun. Okay, and uh, we're, we, uh, 
he took first player, so we're going with Fleet Ambush. We got the, 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 the obstacles, and we have the deployment zone here, and so we're going to see how deployment goes for this right, one. So we were all set up. Um, Starhawk kind of right in the middle, and uh, I was able to kind of deploy everybody trying to go directly at the flagship. Uh, it'll be fun to see if I can bring this big boy down. He's got uh, engineering captains, and I think he's going to be repairing a lot. So we'll see if we'll have some fun here. All right, so he's... Uh, I, I moved this guy up first. Oh, wow, I just... Whoa, did you see that? Did you see that? I just bumping things. Sorry. You can do whatever you want. Um, all right, so he's going here, and he, and he just attacked me with the Starhawk coming back to my side and uh, rolled three red doubles, um, which is just like... Oh, this is how this game is going to be. I can see it. So uh, really lucky dice. And he's using my dice, too, so I'm like, thank you. All right, so end of round two. We just kind of move forward. A little bit of shooting here. Not much happened. Begin. This guy moves in a speed three. Definitely threatening this guy here, but we're, this is all just going to be a big, nasty punch and brawl with no squadrons on either side. And I'm getting ready to see if I can maybe take out this uh, assault frigate. All right, so uh, he moved that guy up. I went with Patriot Fist, went to the front of the uh, assault frigate. Um, we were at close range, but I put another raid. So he had two raid tokens on him, and then with uh, swivel mounts, TK. Uh, and then, of course, my actual front two black dice. I had a whole bunch of uh, concentrated fire and spent a token. Uh, he even made me re-roll some, but I still had the black crit in there. And that was just in one accuracy to stop the brace was enough to bring him down. So, uh, so I forget his down, and, but this guy still has to move, which brings, is going to bring him a little bit closer to the star. Right, beginning of round three, this Starhawk is getting close. He's got double arc to the side here. I had to take this guy off the mount because he was... This thing is obnoxiously huge, uh, but I have a feeling my flagship is going to suffer a little bit. Now, before you roll these dice... Mm -hmm. Thermal shields it. Well, you're doing the side shot first? Yes. I don't know if I want a thermal shields in this one. You would get three red and two blue. And where are you going? You're going to the side? You're going to the front, right? Side to front? Side to front. I got... Uh, you got three blue. I got high capacity turbines. So you got three blue and three red. Um, you've got Kate Kinnon Sholin also. Do you have any special blue crit stuff here? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, Perfect. But your all your all your defense tokens are readied, right? Yeah. Sorry. All right. So I will. I'll, I'm gonna spend a. I'm gonna spend a brace. I'm gonna thermal shields it, and I think I'm gonna remove all three blue. Smart. That's what I do. Yeah. All right. Okay, here I go. Oh, you did still got an accuracy despite that. But it's. But do you want to Kate Kinnon Sholin? On this one? I don't think no. you do. Nope. Sure right. don't. Um, all right. So that just looks. It looks like one shield. Yeah. All right, end of round three. The Starhawk has four health left and has got every single raid token <laughs> on no it. So it's not, re and it has no more shields. So the Starhawk's probably going down this turn. Uh, but my, my flagship burned both braces on both thermal shield shots. I, I, I just I made sure to do it because it, it kept me alive. I've only got uh, five damage on me, but I'm out of a brace token and I'm out of a lot of my shields. And no redirect. I have a redirect and I have three shields here, but you, have, salvo. you have XI7. Yeah, I can't salvo anymore. But the XI-7 is, is hurt a little bit, so uh, we'll see what happens. All right, in the end, it came down to the Liberty, and I rotated the Swivel Mount turret to the side, uh, and he almost he almost got me. He got me, uh, got me to within within three on this guy, and this guy was kind of low. He had uh, he had almost only one shield left, but, uh, but yeah, the Starhawk really fought the good fight. It, it it stood it stood fast and absorbed. Every single ship I had, throwing everything I had at it, it eventually went down. But this guy coming in from the side was, uh, he came in really fast, but the, I think the saving grace was all the raid tokens stopping Leia. I think that was... 110%. Yeah, yeah, so very, very fun. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it. Uh, won both of my games with this fleet. It is always fun to bring, uh, you know, a TF-17 uh, list or getting all those extra black dice as well as Patriot Fist. I'm actually at a point right now where every time I'm building a Separatist fleet, I have a hard time not running Patriot Fist. Uh, I feel like it's like the, the, the number one option available for the Separatists and, uh, you know, like I don't know, maybe the most fun also. Um, but yeah, go ahead and let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to enter to win the giveaways. We've got uh, a couple going on. And uh, you just got to be a subscriber and leave a comment on this or one of my videos. I'm trying to get more Armada games in. Uh, hopefully getting some more games in at Sci-Fi City also. Um, AKA the new name for it is FLGS Orlando. That's my local store. But big thanks to Campus Cars and Games for hosting monthly events. Uh, so again, great stores here in Orlando, Florida. If you're looking to get some Armada in, it's a great city to live in and or around. I will talk to you guys later. I will... I guess that's about it. Uh, big thanks to my patrons. You guys are amazing and help make this all possible. So thank you for your continued support. I will talk to you later. And as always, may the force be with you.